Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Niranjana from Leo Tales and today we will be reviewing the brand Siathe of London. So this brand, I got this particular box uh, from the Sephora US website through a friend and it was priced at $44. The reason why I thought I'll review it because this brand is right now available in India on Mintra and Nykaa and the deluxe samples which are present in the box, most of them are available in full size on these websites. So if you like the products then you can actually go ahead and buy them. Inside the kit you have 11 deluxe samples and one full size product. They are all best sellers of the brand Ciate of London and the packaging itself is really very cute. This box as it is, it is not available in India but as I said you will get the products. So it has a whole lot of carnival and festive feeling to it and this is how the back side of the box looks like and once you open the box it's even better it has these uh, festival and all the designs going on and the products they are packed in a numerical order 1 to 12 and each package has a specific design to it now you know why i bought this box and in 44 dollars this was a steal deal for me so now we'll move on starting from 1 to 12 and a mini review of each product Product number one is here and this is how the packaging is. Such a cute packaging. It says put on some lipstick and live a little. Very beautiful packaging for each and it is a liquid lipstick and this is how it is. This is in the shade O Honey and this is their Velvet Matte Liquid Lipstick range and we have a shade indication also. And this is how the shade looks like. It is a peachish brown kind of shade it i think it goes well with orange and red kind of outfits i like it it is a good daily wear nude it will look extremely good on fair to medium skin tones and in one swipe you get a good color payoff also they are a little drying not extremely drying like a li lipstick but a little bit drying so if you exfoliate well it should be fine or if you apply a little bit of gloss on top of them it should still be fine they do have a some smell to it but that is okay once you apply it it will just wear off and after maybe like uh, four to five hours if you have a meal or something then they'll just vanish from the inside of your lips so it wouldn't crumble or accentuate your dry lines so overall the liquid lipstick seems to be impressive next is product number two and here is the cute packaging it says amore and it says i could stop buying makeup but i am not a quitter yes that is very very true i've been proving that and this is the second product it is a highlighter so it is the glow to highlighter and they have two shades and the one that we have here is the shade moon dust the shade indication is at the back side wow that is a beautiful bling so this is how the shade looks like it is not too silver not too golden it has a uh, a more like a rose gold like finish and it suits the Indian skin tone very well the medium Indian skin tone I have it on face right now so without the spectacles I guess you get a better idea I love that glow it's a very natural glow and not something over the top you can use it as a daily wear also so that is how product 2 the moon dust highlighter looks like Next is product number three and it is again a liquid lipstick. It says be as bold as your lipstick. Again, a beautiful packaging. I like that cocktail glass kind of packaging. And this is how the liquid lipstick looks like. The shade we have here is Pin Up. It is a beautiful shade and I have it on my lips right now with a little bit of gloss. So this is how Pin Up looks like. And it's uh, if you like nude shades, if you are a more nude fan, then this is a shade that you must own in your box. So anyway, this is my favorite shade and that is product number three in the Seat of London box. Moving on to the fourth product, this is how the packaging is. It says home is where your makeup stash is. And this is one of the three eyeshadows that we have in the box and it is in the shade Dainty. Details and shade indication are at the back side. So that is the shade dainty and as you can see a little bit similar to the highlighter you can actually use it as a highlighter also if you want a very subtle glow nevertheless it will be a good shade to create a daily wear makeup look for your eyes and it is not very uh, powdery or anything it glides smoothly and the formula is pretty okay next is product number five and here is the packaging it says rock coal it is a gel coal and this is how the back side is it says just wing it life eyeliner everything the packaging is very cute it has a silver uh, holographic kind of packaging and this is how the gel coal liner looks like it is the wonderland variant and i think they have at least uh, five no 10 shades to choose from and the one that i got in the box is black and on the one side there is a brush that you can use to create a smoky eye this is how the pencil looks like 
here is the swatch in a single swipe this is the color that you get it is a jet black color no doubt about that and it is it uh, it kind of glides well on your eye area also i use it on my upper lids and i like the formula it's very convenient it is a sharpenable kind of pencil but that's okay and i like the packaging also it's very pretty black and silver and it's available in india so that is product number 5 for you next is product number 6 and it is the only full size product in the box and also a favorite of mine it says never ask a girl with a winged eyes why she is late uh well we we all can agree to that the packaging is beautiful and here we have this is their fierce flicks sketch eyeliner it is a full size product of 1.7 ml very beautiful packaging with a black body and stars and everything and this is how the sketch looks like so that is the color in one swipe uh it is not too runny not too dry it is very actually it is very easy to apply on your eyes and it dries out pretty quickly if you are a beginner i would definitely recommend getting a sketch eyeliner because it gives you uh, a better precision when you're applying and i think this is available in india so this is definitely a favorite of mine and it is going to be the sixth product in the box the seventh product is again a liquid lipstick and the packaging is so cute it says kiss mus and at the back side again something is written about lipsticks it says on a bad day there is always lipstick well i agree with that and here is the liquid lipstick it is in the shade delight it is similar to our first product liquid lipstick in the shade oh honey but anyway let's see a swatch of this so this is how the shade delight looks like it is more lighter than oh honey and when you apply on lips uh it sort of washes me out so it is not exactly a shade that i would like i can use it with maybe a lip liner but uh i like oh honey and pin up a little better than delight i have seen this being listed on a lot of websites so this is one of their best selling shades also so that is product number 7 for you here we have product number 8 and probably the cutest packaging it says ulala and it also says blending is my cardio and here we have the next eye shadow and this is in the shade unconditional it will be a good eye shadow base kind of shade compared to the first shade which was dainty this has more of a smooth matte finish so this was our first shade and this is how the second shade looks like it is very very light actually uh, it will be like a good base that you can use to create and yeah it's good in a way because one one is a very shiny kind of shade whereas the other is more of a uh, matte finish kind of shade so in a way that is good and that is product number 8 for you which is the eye shadow in the shade unconditional next is product number 9 and it is the classic red bus of london and it says success is the only option because i love expensive makeup well <laughs> it is true and this is the packaging and here we have a bronzer and i like the packaging of the bronzer because for all the eye shadows and highlighter the packaging was like throw away whereas this bronzer has a solid packaging you are getting 2.2 grams of the product and this is their famous bamboo bronzer and this is how the bronzer looks like so one thing about the shade is it's a uh, it's matte like very comfortable but it's too light like here we have the highlighter and this is how the shade looks like so it will be a good for daily wear but not if you want to create that that you know dramatic makeup look it doesn't have any sort of shimmer to it so it makes it a good daily wear so the bamboo bronzer by siat will make the ninth product in the box and which is as good as a full size at 2.2 grams now in the makeup box makeup as well as a makeup remover is equally important so here we have a makeup remover as the 10th product and this is how the packaging is and at the back side it says i woke up like this flawless so super cute packaging and here we have the makeup melter this is the classic makeup melter by siat so this is how the makeup melter looks like it's a very beautiful design a frosted bottle and it has a metallic cap with the siat bow knot here i haven't started using it yet it is because i have makeup melters and all right now which are open so once i finish them i'll use it and at the bottom some details are also mentioned here this is really heavy because of the packaging and the packaging is definitely pretty The eleventh product that we have here, it is the last and the third eyeshadow in the box. It says 
too glam to give a damn. It is in the shade Fierce and this is definitely a favorite shade of mine. So this is how the shade looks like and once you swatch it, you see that it's like a multi-color. So here we're gonna swatch. See, it is, oh, it's so beautiful, right? It has a, um, uh, it has a, a bit of a mauve and a multicolor kind of I love 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 this particular shade this will be excellent to create some um, party wear kind of eye looks and this is definitely a favorite product of mine so amongst all the three eyeshadows fierce is my favorite and uh, this is the 11th product in the box you're getting 1.1 grams and a very beautiful eyeshadow shade now we are left with only one product in the box which is the last as well as the 12th it says warp 12 and this naming is just perfect because this is my favorite product in the box. It says the only drama that I enjoy is on my lashes. So you can definitely expect the product and it is nothing but a mascara. It is the Wonderland mascara. The packaging is very beautiful. It has a silver body with some white stars on it. Uh, this is a sample size product, but this mascara works like a charm. I love this one. So this is how the mascara wand looks like. Because of the unique shape, it, it adds a lot of length to the mascara. Not much of a volume, but for a daily, day-to-day -day basis, I love this mascara. The kind of length it adds to my lashes, I have very short lashes basically. So, And also it is not a waterproof one. You can wash it off easily. And for me, that is a big advantage because that is my perfect kind of daily wear mascara. So I definitely like the Wonderland mascara and be it the packaging, be it the lengthening effect. The 12th and the last product in the box is definitely my favorite here. So that's it about this video. We have come to the end of unboxing and trying out the Ciate of London 12 Days of Christmas kit. The packaging is really very pretty and it does make a good gift. Now coming to the individual products, um, there are a couple of products that I did not like. For example, uh, I did not like all the three eyeshadows. I liked only one of them, which was the Fierce. And uh, the bronzer again was not a great fan and one of the lip shades was also not very good. But I look forward to buying the full size versions of uh, Pin-up liquid lipstick, the mascara, the sketch eyeliner, the highlighter. These were some products that I really liked, even the makeup melter. Uh, so all the eye products and some of other products are my favorites from the box. And I feel that in $44, if you can get the box, that will be a good deal. And even if you want to try out this luxury brand, you can go ahead and buy some of these uh, full-size products. You will not regret the purchase. The brand is also cruelty-free. That's a big, big plus. So that's it about this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know if you guys want more of these videos. I love making these for you. So that's it. Let me know which all products are your favorite. If you would like to try the brand, if you've already tried it, I'd like to know that from you guys. So we'll meet soon with another video. Until then, take care. Bye.